Hi everyone, this is Kamel. As your ultimate source of video editing, we're here to share with you some useful editing tips and techniques that could boost your video creation and take it to the next level. But before we start, make sure you free download the software through the link we put in the description box down below. All right, now let's keep exploring how to fake camera movements with some motion effects in Video Proc Flagger. And in today's video, we'll focus on boom shot. Boom shots involve the entire camera ascending or descending from moving vertically in relation to a certain subject. When there isn't a Cree, Jeep, or other professional counterway systems to control the camera movements, we can use Video Pro Flagger to simulate boom shots. It can make our videos shot by static cameras look like they're recorded by cameras moving vertically. Let's walk through two common uses of simulating camera boom shots. First, review information. The boom shot in film can help filmmakers enrich the thematic language and review a subject or a scene. In daily video editing tasks, we can also use boom shot to spice up our videos. Now let's take a look how to fake a boom shot in Video Proc Flagger. Launch up the software. Start a new project. Import this video. Preview the video. We can find the three soldiers are coming head on towards. Drag this clip onto video track. Drag the play head to the proper position. Click on split to trim off the redundant clips. Find the motion icon under the preview window. Click on it to enter the motion editor panel. Here we can get dozens of different motion presets. Let's select move up to get the boom shot effect. Click on add. We can find that we just added two keyframes which indicating that the camera starts to move up at the first frame and it ends the moves when it reaches the second keyframe. I need a faster camera moving effect, so here I select a second keyframe. Drag it to here. Let's preview the outcome. We have made a boom camera movement effect, but the frames after the second keyframe looked unedited. Let's add some tweaks. Move the playhead to the last frame. Find the Add Keyframe button. Click on that. Now we added the third keyframe. The parameter settings and these are the same as the second keyframe. So we can get the same effect into the frames followed by. Click on Apply. Have a look at the result. The fake camera movement effect makes the original video more appealing, isn't it? Second, follow the character's movements. Boom shots can also help filmmakers follow a character's movement for capturing his surroundings. They can also use boom shot to reflect a more emotional journey for the character. We are shooting a video like this which look and play. You can go to Video Proc Flagger to edit the video. Drag it onto Video Track. In the same way, click on the motion icon to enter the motion editor panel. The man is moving from up to down. So here, let's add a move down preset. Then adjust the parameter settings for the two keyframes. After the changes, let's preview the outcome. I think the speed of the camera moving down doesn't match the man's movements. So I drag the playhead to there. Hit add a keyframe. Adjust the parameters for this keyframe on the left window. Apply the same tweaks on this position. That's all. 
Don't forget to add a keyframe after the end of the move down effect for getting the same effect into the frames followed by. Hit apply. Now we've completed the finishing touches for our edits. Let's preview the outcome. We faked a boom shot within simple clips. Alright, now you've reached the end of today's video about simulating camera boom shots in Video Prog Flagger. I think I've got it. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you in our next tips. Hope you enjoy. Bye.